Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forex pisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Greetings everybody guys, right now let's take a look at the bond market. As you can see, situation barely has changed since our discussion in weekly research. So Monday session, as you can see, was really very small action, so very small range. Since side session to Friday action, market was approximately scrolling around uh, 1270 area. And here on the daily chart, at least on the daily chart, we have only one tool that could help us somehow is the harmonic swings. So uh, in general, if you will separate the left side and the right side, you'll see that's very pretty harmonic uh, in terms of in terms of the price behavior. And uh, that led us to suggest, uh, at least not even to suggest, but at least to watch for the area that by the logic of the harmonic swing should be should become the top. And it stands approximately 1275, 1277 area. So market stands very close to it. Uh, because here we could we could get a bearish reversal, some bearish patterns if this so indeed will happen on the intraday charts. That will be maybe not bad a scenario for trading. Because currently as you can see in the gold market we uh, really has the difficulties with the patterns because we don't have any clear patterns for trading. So yes, here we have uh, bullish hidden then, then uh, bullish divergence that theoretical is just taking out of the stop. Because usually when market forms the hidden divergence, it usually leads to further upward direction. But right now, we do not see any signs of that. The overall action here is very gradual. Also, as we have talked already many times, that we have no support here from the by the physical purchasing of the gold. Uh, so no real purchases stands here on the physical market. That makes this uh, rally is not very reliable and it's really fragile. And any even minor sign, pure sign here could trigger the strong collapse down. Because no strong foundation, no strong support, no strong buyings uh, makes drop very easy. So currently we're still watching for this area because here something we could, could get something would form here. On the follow time frame chart, we have come to agreement that probably we should wait for either clear patterns or uh, breaking of the tendency. So currently, as you can see, despite that market stopped somewhere in the, in the middle of this channel, it keeps well the upside tendency. So we have the high lows and high highs are forming here. Market stands inside of the channel, so not, no problems with you right now. And uh, yesterday we said that probably market could make another attempt to go higher to complete the harmonic swing on the daily chart. That's approximately the 1277, as I said. It's also accompanied by the weekly pivot resistance one. So everything stands mostly the same as we have discussed in the weekly research. The major difference we have on the hourly chart. So take a look that on it's a bit uh, noisy picture here, but we need some indicators to talk about. So. Uh, if you remember here, we have talked about the possible wage pattern or some kind of the three drive uh, sell inside of the four hour time frame channel. And market actually has completed it. So you can see here is a con uh, con consolidation of the 1618 extension of this swing, 127 on that swing, seven butterfly inside of it. But market is calling flat. It's no real drop here, we see. Uh, also, take a look at this fast acceleration here. And here are very minor, very small retracements. Here is growth approximately 50%, but even maybe 3, just 3. Here is also just 3, it's very fast acceleration. It means that maybe market could move slightly higher. Currently, guys, I think that it's not, it's a bit dangerous to take the position based on this free drive. Also, take a look at this behavior, right at the top of this free drive pattern. This behavior reminds me the very bullish dynamic pressure because take a look, market is forming high lows. Trend has should bearish. Break section mostly stands in upward direction. It means that this this top would be taken out very soon. 
that inst that uh, could lead to action right to 1277 area. So maybe market will form something here. So maybe some head and shoulders will be formed here later. This market will completely harmonic swing on the daily chart. I do not know. But currently, guys, although situation looks bearish, so on the first glance we have clear bearish passions, wedge passion and straight drive, some, something of that sort. But it's a bit tricky moment and it's not uh, very attractive right now taking into consideration this action that we have on the top of this passion. Uh, that's why personally I probably will not trade this passion on the bearish side of the market and will watch for more clarity on the call. So that's what we see right now in the market. It seems that we still have to wait when the market will hit final destination point 1275, 1277, and after that we'll see what will happen. As on the daily chart with this uh, some kind of harmonic reversal or something of that sort, I don't know how to better call it, maybe compiled hand or something of that sort. As with this passion, as with the channel, whether it will be broken up, the market will hit this area or not. So that's what we will do on the gold market in the nearest time.